Today's guitar tutorial is on Agua de Beber by Antonio Carlos Obim. This song featured on the album The Composer of Desafinado Plays, which was released in 1962. The title means Water to Drink, and it was composed by Carlos Obim with the lyrics by Vinicius de Moraes. So what we're doing is playing thirds and fourths, thirds here and the E and the A together, um, sort of as a little riff. So your right hand fingers, I am going to play the C and the A on the second and third string and then move to the third and fourth string. At the same time, we've got the bass melody just playing open string A, B, B, B on beats one and three. All right, and then we move to E, back to the A minor chord. All right. Okay, so when we shift to the B7, it's a little bit of a jump, so that might take a little, a little getting used to. So when we go to the B7, it's a B7 bar chord, and we keep playing the D sharp, then C, D natural, and then hammer the D sharp. So. It's, we're just playing that second string. You could also play it rest stroke. And then we go to an E7, so E7 augmented. And I like to roll. And then jump. We go to F, the sixth bar, we go to an F major seven chord. Continuing on this riff on the third and fourth string, but the F goes in the bass. And then what I've done is I've brought that riff to the first and second string. So we're going to go same thing, but it's uh, an octave up. And I just play it like with the third finger and the first finger. You could also play it with third and fourth, which is actually not a bad way to do it. Or you could go, all right, and then. Eighth bar, we go. Now, this is our E7 augmented chord. Then we're on to the A section. All right, so we're going to play as a, as a melody on its own. Okay, and then we're going to go to our B7 chord. So it's kind of melody accompaniment. E, and then we go to our E7 augmented chord. Back to our A minor chord. Which is anticipated. Okay, back to our melody. This time we're going up to a G. And this little rhythm, this little syncopated rhythm keeps coming back, which is kind of the holds the melody together. Now we're going to go to our D minor six, slide up to the A, and then down to the G13, all right, which is, as you can see on the music, so we're going to go, and then, so it's our G13 with the top E, and then we're going to play the E here, and then finish it off with the C major 7 chord, all right, okay, back to our melody, B7, Flat sharp 11, A minus 7, G sharp diminished. I really enjoy that chromatic passage, that movement of chords within a sort of a short chromatic space. Notice that the bass is still moving on beats one and three. All right, then we're gonna to move to our C and then finish the chord off. All right, and these cool chords, these diminished sharp five chords. bar, F7 to our E7 and then back to the melody and then I bring the A minor to the fifth position like that. That's it for me, thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more Latin Guitar Mastery videos. See you next time.